Neither Barry Landau nor his attorneys would comment after a sentence was handed down Wednesday. Landau got seven years in prison, followed by three years supervised probation for pleading guilty to theft and conspiracy. I think it's an appropriate sentence. You know, we hope that uh, Mr. Landau's uh, fall and Mr. Landau's imprisonment will be a powerful deterrent to anybody else who would consider stealing items from national libraries. Landau and co-defendant Jason Savidoff were charged with stealing at least 60 historical documents from several museums along the East Coast, including the Maryland Historical Society. Many of those documents were presented at the sentencing. The judge was also shown a sport coat and trench coat with altered pockets more than a foot deep that prosecutors say the pair used when stealing documents. I think that uh, the evidence that was exhibited in court today showed that Mr. Landau engaged in a scheme not just for the period during which he was working with Mr. Savidoff, but in fact for an extended period of time before that. The prosecution said, quote, Mr. Landau has made a career out of being deceitful, and they gave many examples of him claiming to have connections he doesn't. They also say he collected personal information on celebrities and political figures and posed as a presidential historian to gain access to special documents. And in fact, that Mr. Landau was masquerading as a presidential historian when in reality he was a con artist who would gain people's trust uh, and then steal their property. The defense asked for a reduced sentence because Landau is 64 and has psychological and medical problems. But the judge stressed this punishment needs to be taken seriously and serve as a deterrent.